How are you doing, Syrah? I would like the sun to be up a bit more. Because I can I can see the what was that? That was a rabbit. Right, I can see the um that it is in fact nearly dawn or something, but everything below where I can tell the sky is It's a bit like I oh pines. I cannot I cannot. <laughs> And I'm not familiar enough... Let's stay out of the foliage. I'm not familiar enough with Dayspring Canyon yet. Am I... St I am still on the road. You're doing quite well, I think. Thank you, Myth. And of course, the question after this is going to be, where might Dexian be? That's a... sconce of some sort? Brazier? Brazier? I don't know if that Z is actually pal uh, palatalized. I have no idea what that even means. It means you or voiced. I would. I should say. Ah, uh, that looks like where we're we going. Basically, it's the difference between brazier and brazier. Understood. Oh, and in here it's not quite worse. Right. Where was Dexian the last time we found him? Out in the middle of the uh, entry. So, your guess is as good as mine. Oh, we're in. Uh, everyone's eating here. See, among them? Uh, no. Oh, where uh, it's trolls there. That was so oh jeez. Sorin Do you have a moment? Gunmar and I have been talking and well, we're slightly worried. We both realized that if Isran's even allowed us in here, he must be really concerned. And if he's that concerned, the situation must be pretty bad. Make sense? Of course. Uh, you're worried about what we're up against. Yes. These vampires are a new threat. And a truly deadly one. Gunmar and I agree that we're going to need Florentius to help. Uh... Gunmar and I have a lot of work to do here. So we were hoping that maybe you could track him down. Who is Florentius? I can certainly try. He's a priest of Arkay. Well, he was. It's... it's complicated. He's a little eccentric, but we can trust him, and we could definitely use his skills. All right, where can we find him? Well, that's the thing. We don't know where he is. Haven't seen him in years. I think he had regular contact with the Vigilance, and I know Isran kept track of them. So maybe you could ask Isran if he knows anything? Just keep in mind that he... well... he might not like the idea. All right. We're not going to have a problem with your little project, are we? Oh. I told well, you. I there's prepared this one. for this. It's going to work. There's enough for us to fight out there. I don't need us having to defend ourselves within our own fort. If you're so worried about the trolls, why agree to let me go ahead with huh. it? We don't have many other options, do oh. we? Sorry, I almost ran into you. Uh... Isran? Be on your guard at all times. Avoid sleep if you can. Sleep is for the weak. 
Uh, right. I need to find someone named Florentius. Do you have any ideas? Who said something? Sorine or Gunmar? I thought they'd have learned their lesson by now. I don't trust that man. And I don't want him here. Uh, fair enough. Forget I said anything. No, just... I suppose she's right. I shouldn't let my personal feelings get in the way. Last I heard of him, he was aiding the vigilance of Stendar at Runvald. He may still be there. If he can maintain some appearance of normalcy, I'll allow him to stay. All right. Stay alert. So, shall we go look for this Florentius, or find Dexian first? I think we should find Dexian first since we're here, and I haven't seen him yet, so... Perhaps we should try the upper floors. Uh, of course, assuming I can find stairs. Or anything of the sort. You've just passed some. Oh. Who? Eh. You know what? We're in the hall of the... The Hall of the Dawn Guard. Of course I'm hearing crossbows. Uh oh. I think the sun might be up. Oh, uh, come back this way. Alright. Oh, sorry about the sun, Sarana. Oh, I hear dogs. Huh. I didn't know we had dogs here. There are dogs all over Skyrim. But perhaps we can go see them. Ah, I found Dexian. Oh? Just walk right ahead. Oh, we must be... I mean, of course we're on a, uh, a higher floor. <laughs> uh... Oh. Sorry to sneak up on you like that, Dexian. I trust your journey was successful? Indeed. I've brought the Elder Scrolls. I'm sorry, my friend. I can no longer be of use in this matter. Why? What's happened? Um, well... It's my fault. In my haste to read the first scroll, I neglected the careful preparation required. I thought I'd be able to allay the after-effects. But I was wrong. Now I am paying for it. What do you mean? Well, his eyes are covered. What do you think he means? Oh. Oh, dear. Blind? Yes, I'm afraid so. Well... You're not alone. I suppose. Although... If your eyes are covered, I assume that you don't even have the little points of light that I do. Can anything be done to help? No. It will have to run its course. And there's always the chance I may never recover. Oh, great. So... So we're finished. No, there is another way. The question is, how much are you willing to risk to find Oriel's bow? Uh, well, <laughs> it's not like I can lose any more of my sight, so what do we need to do? I can't guarantee you'd be free from harm. Becoming blind could be the least of your worries. Well, don't worry about that. <laughs> Anyway, just... what is it we need to do? Scattered across Tamriel are secluded locations known only as Ancestor Glades. There's one in Skyrim, in the Pine Forest. Performing the ritual of the Ancestor Moth within the Glade should provide the answers you seek. Okay. Explain this ritual. It involves carefully removing the bark from a canticle tree, which will in turn attract Ancestor Moths to you. Once enough of the moths are following, they'll provide you with the second sight needed to decipher the scrolls. Carefully gather the bark. 
How? In keeping with tradition, you must use a specific tool in the Ancestor Glade, an implement known as a draw knife. Every moth priest is taught this ritual, but few ever get the chance to perform it. You should consider yourself fortunate if it works for you. I certainly will. Um, do I need to read the scrolls in any particular order? Do you think you can? I'll get back to you on that. From what I saw in the vision, the Elder Scroll which foreshadows the defiance of the gods with the blood of mortals is the key to the prophecy. Right, so... Is it normal for moth priests to go blind? Sadly, yes. It is the inevitable fate we agree to pursue when reading the Elder Scrolls. It generally does not occur until a moth priest is in his latter years. But in my case, I simply was not preparing myself properly. What went, what went wrong? Deciphering one of the Elder Scrolls is nothing like reading a simple book. There is quite a bit of ritual and concentration required. It can take months or even years to complete a single scroll, and even then, months to recover. Wonderful. Although I have to ask, out of curiosity and scholarly interest, how are moths related to the Elder Scrolls? Well, as I'm sure you figured out by now, it's no mere coincidence that we're named Moth Priests. The voice of the Ancestor Moth has always been an integral part of reading the Elder Scrolls. In what way? I don't think I've ever heard a moth make a sound before, so... Oh, the moths don't literally read the scrolls, but they maintain a connection to ancient magic that allows the moth priests to decipher them. If you listen closely when you find the glade, you should be able to hear their song, a soft, harmonious trilling. It's through this ancestral chorus that the moths tap into a form of primal augur and become a conduit for deciphering the scrolls. A primal augur? How does that help? By having the ancestor moths close to the moth priest, they can utilize the conduit and share the moth's augury. Only the most resilient of priests can do it this way. It takes years of practice to interpret the harmony. Oh! Okay, so it's mostly hearing and not reading. Sort of. So I actually stand a chance of doing this, then? You've come this far, and you've found several Elder Scrolls. Whether you believe it or not, the Scrolls have a mind of their own. If they did not want you to find them, they would not allow it. Because of this, I strongly believe you were meant to hear the Ancestral Chorus. Only one way to find out. Oh... Thank you, Dexian. Good luck. I hope you find the answers you seek. So do I. Oh. You're right. I wouldn't say you're exactly pale, but... You look a bit shocked. I'm... It's sort of a... Not exactly a coincidence. I feel like it's it's too perfect to be a coincidence. What is? The fact that I'm blind already, and yet there's this ritual that might allow me to read an Elder Scroll. Or, well, not... Not blind blind, but... It's... <laughs> it's not exactly useful, the amount that I can see. I can see, I can tell where you are, and I can, I think that's Serana, right there, but, um, right, it's, uh, it's mostly, 
it's mostly just light and shadows that I can read. Like, I'm seeing through a pinprick of light. So it's... Maybe I can do this. I can... I'm excited. I'm very excited. Uh, we should probably go... Right, we have two things that we could be doing, right? We could be going to the Ancestor Glade, wherever that is. Or... Trying to find, uh, the Priest of Arche. Correct? Correct. Perhaps we should go read the scrolls first. Just in case we have a time limit. You know that is a wonderful... I knew it would come to this one day. Sorry? I knew. And no one believed. I could not see you in front of the door. <laughs> Sorry, Isran. Right, and now I try not to stab myself on the- I hope we reach Ancestor Glade soon. Guardrails, thank you for your vote, Serana. I am- I'm terribly excited, a little bit just terrified. Why is that? Uh, first of all, because I can't tell where- I heard the dogs again. Can we go? We can go see the dogs first. Well, okay, maybe. Where are the... Hello? Hello, dogs. Can I pat them? <laughs> I assume so. They're armored. They're not like dogs that I've seen elsewhere in Skyrim. Hello? Oh! <laughs> Aren't you just the most adorable things? Hello? Are you two vampire hunters? Myth? Can we take one along? I don't see why not. We can try anyway. Alright. Do they have names on their collars or anything? They do. This one is Bran that you're talking to. The other one is, uh... I don't know how you're supposed to pronounce it, but Scaling. It's probably Sheeling, but I'm not sure. Anyway, Bran! Do you want to go hunt vampires with us? Let's go. <laughs> oh, what a good boy. Right, okay. Um, I'm not sure where Serana's gone. But I'm very excited. I'm so pleased. Look at you! Oh, I'm... So there you are. Serana, we have a dog. His name is Bran. I'm excited. Shall we away there? Yes, okay. Uh, we have... Oh, sorry. We have backup. Sort of. We have a, a... A sniffer. Someone who can detect vampires before the rest of us, probably. Aside from Serana. Now we need to figure out which way is... Out. Uh, which way is out? I assume it's this way. <laughs> oh, we have a dog. We have a dog and... Oh, thank you, Bran! Oh, sorry. Are you- are you going to lead me places? Uh, I don't think he's trained for that. <laughs> I have heard of that, uh, being done before. Of people training dogs to help with, you know, leading the visually impaired. Which, you know, could be useful, but again, as you said... Yes, Brian? <laughs> Well, 
They've built up some of the place around here. Right, I'm going to get out of her way. She's always out here firing at something. Try not to get shot. Oh, this is so much nicer. The sun is out. Right, Ancestor Glade first. Assuming we can figure out what that is. It's Serana. Oh, what is it? Do you have any ideas? I will take that as a no. Right. Where might an ancestor clade be? I don't know. Well, great. Uh, maybe we do go find Florentius first. Because maybe he knows. Hmm. Or maybe Bran knows. I wonder. Can we have him sniff an Elder Scroll and see if it take if he takes us anywhere? I, maybe. Hmm. Trying to come up with any other way we might be able to. Oh. Figure something out. Do I have on my person? I do not. Oh, uh, scrolls. Scrolls. Nope, no scrolls of clairvoyance. I know how to use scrolls. Oh. Right. Ooh, what? Well, you have to be able to read scrolls. Like, properly read them. I cannot do that with these eyes. I hear the waterfalls and I enjoy them. The glaciers. Yeah, you 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 told me that once. Okay, right. Uh So I think, right, given that we don't actually know where this Ancestor Glade is, we go find the eccentric priest of Arche first at Runvold, which that one I assume Soreen or Isran actually marked for us. I believe so. Yes. It's a bit out of the way, though. That is all right. Let's go do that. Careful, Zira. Okay. <laughs> Ah. Oh dear. Bear's having a conversation. Bran, stay. Good boy. Careful again. Oh, where'd you come from? That'll teach you. Oh. Well, Lovely day in the reach. The rift? We're in the rift. Right, I know what parts of Skyrim are which. Good job, Bran. Where'd you come from? Oh. Right into my arm. Oh, hello. That's the other one. And 
done. Oh, proud of you, all right. <laughs> Where'd you come from? There's the other one. Ah! Oh. That'll teach you. Serana! Ugh. Ugh. I don't mind fighting spiders, but they sound so disgusting when they move. Don't they just... Gods, right. Where are we going? We've lost entire track of basically anything. We're going uh, just up the ridge in front of you, so. Alright. Assuming I can figure out where the ridge is. Ah, I think I figured out where the ridge is. Oh hey, what is this plant? I believe that's canis root. It's blooming. It smells good. Uh, stopping to smell the flowers. In the snow. Actually, sort of makes me feel better. Right. Uh, which side of the bridge are we going up? Your left. Okay. Duh. I assume that's Serana Spider since somebody isn't attacking it. It's correct. Okay. Is this a way up? I can't tell. It's sort of seems like it. Uh, this seems more likely though. Maybe? Maybe not. How does one reach? Room bold. Maybe up here. Uh... Oh yeah. This is all scree under here, I think. Which makes a certain amount of sense given that I feel like we are in the foothills of the Velothes right now. That would be correct, yes. Well, it's like a Either a landslide carved this out, or a glacier did. And given it, it's the Velothes, I assume a landslide. Aha! Uh -huh. So this ground underfoot? Probably not super... Um... Even? Steady? Something like... Ooh, wolves. We overshot it, I think. Up. Uh I've tripped over a fox. Uh, right, this is... Keep hands on wall time. <laughs> to your left. Oh, I found Bran. Indeed. No tree. Uh, how did we... Spend a whole- hey, hello, spiky. Spend a whole day trying to find- I can no longer see a thing. I can see a thing. Oh, uh, I think we found it. Fantastic. Good boy, Brad. Making friends with the wildlife? Oh, it sounds like a mine. Um, be careful. Why? 
Right. Bran isn't exactly going to be stealthy about this, but there's somebody down there with a red aura around their head. And I don't think Bran likes it much. All right. Hello, Bran. Good boy. All right, let's go. You can't Where'd hide you come from. from. Found you. Fools! Is this what you want? Uh, God damn you! Oh! <laughs> done and done. There we are. Oh, you're dropping arrows everywhere. Sorry. Um, who are these people? I think they're the vigilance that. Uh, that Isran mentioned. I couldn't remember if it was Isran or Serene. And locked. Right. Uh, here we go. I'm only taking point because I have the heaviest armor. Hold on, there's a, a journal here. Okay, what does it say? It is... Give me a moment. M. Sidri. Oh, this is just the excavation log. That would follow. All right. I am so thankful for torches. I realize where I came from originally and that my accent might make the word torches sound like something else. <laughs> Who's there? Hello. That'll teach you. Uh, come back, Bran. That is fire. No, oh, you know. I've never actually considered carrying a torch myself, but that might be not the worst idea. Oh, where'd you come from? Angry dog. Done and done. Oh, nice job, Bran. <laughs> Who's there? Ah. Uh? That'll teach you. Hey, Saron has a dog now too. Did you undead a dog? Ew. Well, I suppose. Oh. <laughs> what? Oh, nothing. Uh, right. Where are we going? Down here, I assume. Because this is where I heard Bran barking. I am going to take the potions. What is this book? That is the Book of Daedra. Oh, uh, might as well. It's always interesting to study Daedra in, your, in one's spare time. Just in case one should ever happen upon Daedra. Or I suppose they're more egregious worshippers. I don't include the average Dunma in that. Now As well you shouldn't. There. Hello? Done and done. That works surprisingly well. I'm amazed. I'm amazed and impressed. Oh, me shouting and uh our little friend charging in? <laughs> Found another journal. Well? Well what? They are indeed Vigilance of Stendar, which I surmise just looking at them. 
Apparently they were dealing with headaches. Uh... Serana! Really? I suppose. Oh, there's more of them. Oh, interesting. Hmm? Nords carved big heads. What? Yeah, put that hammer away for a second. Alright. Excuse me. Now come over here. Feel that. Huh? Oh! You are correct, a big... Is that a... F I assume that's a face. It is. It's very odd. I've seen sort of faces like that in the uh, couple of Dwemer ruins we've been in. Except made of brass, obviously. I think it's brass. Given that, uh... They often did things in pursuit of making a... Hello! A brass god. Oh. This ends now. Oh. Well, that was a bit of a scrum, wasn't it? Anyway, I think you're right. I believe it's brass. That does make sense. Uh, oh, this is Serana's husky. I assume they're huskies. I've never actually seen one in person, but I've heard of them. Uh, describe a husky? Well, uh, sort of black and white and fuzzy and, uh, a bit fluffier, like thicker fur than the average Someone there? Nordic hound. Then yes, now I think they're mine. huskies. Fools! Who's there? Go get him, Bran. I knew I heard something. Hello? <laughs> oh. Hello. Done and done. Very nice. I think you might have disarmed him. That would be fantastic. Do not like fight. Oh, I'm so lost. <laughs> uh, oh, rock hammer. Journal. Oh, great. Yes, more headaches. Question. Yes. Potentially answer? Who is Minorn? Ah? Uh, I have no idea. Oh. Oh? Well, I believe that M. Sidri may have been going a bit mad. I was going to ask if Minorn was some sort of Altma goddess, potentially. But then it looked to me like M. Sidri was simply replacing words with the name Minorn. So, who knows? Careful. Uh huh. There's a trap on the floor. Right. Is there a way to. Not really. You may have to just jump over it. Okay. Oh. Well, that's. That's easily enough dodged. Oh. Well. Was. Uh, found an ore vein of some sort, I think? Looks like malachite, potentially. Interesting. Is that the sort of thing that you expect to find in the Balafi Mountains? Malachite and ebony, mostly, yes. Now you're mine. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oops. Someone can't hide from me. Found you. What you want? Done and done. Oh. Who's there? Oh gods. Now you're mine. Oh. Alright. Done and this done. ends now. 
You can't beat me. Fools! Oh, you got them. Did I miss Bran? Indeed. Wonderful. Uh... Well... Sorry, sir. There's Bran. Good boy. Oh, who's there? Done and done. Very nice. Very, very nice. Gotta clean this dagger off. You know... Somehow it never occurred to me that you fight with a dagger. Well, mostly. I mean, I've said it before, haven't I, that I'm a dagger man? Well, yes, but... The implications have never sunk in before now. You fight with daggers, you kill people for a living, and you're a bit shady around the edges. Oh, and also you keep talking about your family in such a way that sort of reminds me of, uh... Ways that one might speak of a, uh, A cartel from Breville or something like that. Braville, however they pronounce it. You think I run a skooma cartel or something? Uh, no. You specifically? No. I don't know why... The potentially the son of somebody who does would fight with daggers and not like... Well, maybe it's just stereotypes that I'm falling into. Fair enough. There's a journal, by the way. Oh, well, this is interesting. The Scripture of Minorn. I have no idea what this is. Oh, but they do have Florentius here. Okay. He doesn't seem to be affected by whatever this thing is. Damn you. Skyrim belongs Teach you to, to mess the with me. Okay. Careful, Zira. They have a storm atronarch. Ah. Are you going to fight a storm atronarch with a dagger? And a bit of shadow magic, perhaps? Oh, right. You do that too. I know what you are. I'm sure you do. Let's just be done with this, shall we? Thought I heard something. Who's there? Oh, hello. Do your do my what? Who's? Hello. I can see that magic. Come on. I'll see you burn. Oh. I yield. I yield. Hey. Can someone help me here? No, oh, we got it. Done and done. You're right. I think so. I barely got hit. Right. We'll talk about that later, shall we? Uh... About what? Okay, you can stop playing dumb now. There are a couple of things that I... still don't understand. Like, why would you claim to be from a forestry guild? Foresters. It's not a lie. Uh-huh. Right. What book is this? Immortal Blood. I think it's about vampires. Which might be useful to keep around. Right. Uh... Deal right is a cage. And in it, I believe, is Florentius. Okay. Uh... And I found a key, which I need to focus to find the actual keyhole. Hello? I knew it! 
I knew RK would save me. I asked for help, and he sent you. You are a very welcome addition to this dreary place, my friend. I owe both you and RK a great deal. I'm sure I'll manage to repay him later. But you, what can I do to thank you? Uh, you can meet me at Fort Dongard. Actually, you can also tell me where to find the uh, Ancestor Glade, but we can get to that later. I suppose I could. What, pray tell, is there? Uh, Fort Dongard? Isran. He needs your help. Isran? My help? Is this some kind of a joke? Did RK put you up to this? Isran's done nothing but mock me. He's never given me the respect I deserve. <laughs> well, I can't speak for RK mocking you, but we do need your help. Look, I've just got myself out of quite a mess here, in case you haven't noticed. And while I appreciate your help, I... What's that? No, that's not what I... Yes, but... Are you sure? Really? Fine. RK says it's a good idea for me to go. I don't agree. But he's not the sort of fellow you can just ignore. I'll see you at Fort Dawnguard then. Don't worry. RK will show me the way. Oh, uh, before you get before you get too far, can you do me a massive favor and uh, show me where on this map, sorry, the ancestor glade might be? I don't know if RK would be able to tell you such a thing, but if you could mark that, I would be. Myth and I would be extremely help uh grateful. Thank you, sir. I'm okay with the dark, but I've spent more than my share of time in caves already. Well, I'm sure a glade is going to be more open, right? Possibly. So he was interesting. Indeed. Uh, where is the way out? Well, he's gone one way, but there's a door right over here. Do you alright? Ah. Oh, ho, ho, it's... There we are. Well, now what? As a chest. Very nice bed. Myth? <laughs> what? It's carved well. That's what you mean. <laughs> ah, sorry. It's been an interesting day. There's a... That's... Uh, an alchemy station from the smell of it. Correct. What is with the Foresters Guild? Ah, well. What's this? That's a lever. Okay. It opened a staircase. So the Foresters Guild is, in fact, it's how you translate Morag Tong. You're joking. I am, in fact, not joking. I'm being honest for once. <laughs> you... <laughs> Me? Yes, sir? You told me when we first met that you were scouting for the Foresters Guild. What if I'd known? Did you actually trust me when you told me that? Uh, mm, I was taking a chance. Oh, gods. <laughs> I hate this staircase already. You were taking a chance on my trust? Or not my trust, but uh, my morals or my ignorance? 
um, a bit of both, truth be told. <laughs> well, at least you're honest about it. Ooh, dark and cold. And spidery. Where'd you come from? That'll teach you. There we go. Oh. Another one. Where'd you come from? Oh, for... Let me hear you. There we are. Oh. Oh, this is wonderful, isn't it? Oh, I am... Oh, I saw that. I don't think we should be up on a mountain in a rain thunder storm thing. And I... Oh... Ha <laughs> ha, myth? Mm hmm This is... Uh, this is a lot more challenging than I'm used to. It's alright. Here, hold on to my shoulder. That, I will do. Oh, boy. Morag Tong. 